Commando. This is the third time that I'm playing Commando. And this time on the MSX. Last time we played an MSX game, it was 1942, and that one I was able to beat, but it was pretty damn choppy. Let's hope that this one is a little bit better. There's only eight stages in the game, same as it was on the arcade. And like, the last four stages are the same as the first four stages. So, I'm debating if we should actually beat all eight stages, or is like four stages enough? Let's see how we're feeling when we actually play it. Because who knows, this game might be too unbearable to go through all eight levels. Oh, I'm gonna, I gotta turn that down. Yep, this, this is not the game in, like, being slowed down. What you are seeing here is Commando on the MSX in real time. You ever wonder, you ever played Commando on the arcade or on the NES and thought, this game moves way too fast, has way too much detail. I want something a little more simplified and slower. This is the conversion for you. Look at this Microsoft PowerPoint flame frame rate and I'm dead. I didn't even get shot, I just got hopped on by someone off a cliff. You can barely see the bullets on screen. Luckily, they move pretty slow, so if you are able to see them, you can walk away from them. You just gotta hope that there's no black dots that's naturally on the ground, or it's gonna be a disaster for you. Isn't this a thing of beauty, when the game gets so busy, you can count the frames on one hand? Are you doing that on Look Love Games to request for next week? Uh, you'll have plenty of time! It's probably gonna take me like three years to reach stage two at this speed. I should have just reset because I already took a death right away. So this could be a terrible thing to have happen if I just game over. Because as far as I know, I don't think this game has any continues. Oh god, I thought that grenade got me. Also, is it just me? It doesn't feel like the encounters at the base feel... longer? Like, just more enemies to be fighting? Hey there, Bragg. Hey there, Neil. <laughs> Interesting music. It's like fax machines from the future. Now rush to the second area. How are we gonna rush? With in this frame rate? Hell no. Well, at least I got an extra life back. God, they even got the vehicles in this. I'll give them credit. 
They made the game as arcade accurate as they could. Even if the hardware was not equipped to do the job. Like, they made no concessions whatsoever. They wanted to put everything in. Even if they had to tweak the sprites and graphics a lot. I don't know how you guys are tolerating this. <laughs> oh boy. I should just get some grenades even though I haven't used any. Okay, that was... That was kinda lame. That enemy disappeared right under the bridge. You couldn't do any layering. So the whole enemy disappears. Oh, come on! Ah, life-giving water. Nectar of the Gods. That's gonna have to wait until I, uh, game over, which is gonna be any second now. Hey, Anubis. Oh, I finally made it past the bridge. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No! I'm dead. This must be an equivalent to DOS? I... Did they ever make that claim? I don't think they ever did. Oh, no, I hit full screen. Apparently, if you hit F at all, it goes to full screen. I had to hit the other button. There were some DOS games that were also very terrible. I mean, there was Contra on DOS. I don't think anyone's saying that one's a masterpiece. Yep, there are no continues. They had to do the whole game in one go. Have fun. You'll get plenty of time to enjoy this masterpiece. That riff there gets a little creepy, I will admit. Oh, I, I didn't even see there was a bullet there. See, look at that. They just go right by the tree and the whole sprite disappears. Because they do no layering whatsoever. At least I got the hostage rescued. Uh, I'm almost tempted to just, like, lurk around, kill as many soldiers as I can so I can start stacking points. But 
God knows they're gonna spawn one right near me and shoot. And then I can't get away. Wouldn't be surprised. Got your first year for PS1, you'll wait. You have to wait! Well, we're not opening it up again until next Monday. You got no choice. Cry like an anime fan on prom night. This frame rate would make any PC gamer cry like an anime fan on prom night. Hey there, MD. Also, I tried to throw another grenade and it wouldn't let me. Is it because I still had an explosion? They only let one explosion be on screen at a time. Oh, that's pathetic. They was like that in the original game, too. Oh, God. Some of them on the left side are just constantly flickering. It's like the sign of a sleazy motel. Now rush through the second area, again. <sighs> There's a long delay, like, uh, at the end screen, too. We're doing? I'm doing okay, except the fact I'm playing this. Out of all the times I've played Commando, this is the worst iteration so far. And I say this with great sincerity, even though the arcade version kicked my ass. At least that one was way more playable. I'm just too worried, I'm just gonna fall in the bed. Oh, come on! God, it's even worse on the bridge. This is like dot matrix printer speed. Holy crap. Ugh. 
Okay, I think we made it to the second hideout. Oh. Points. The thing is, like, when you turn around, you don't get to shoot right away. So, that becomes an issue if you're trying to, like, get someone in a snap. Oh, I'm dead. Hey there, Joker and the Shard. I need to see you all. Even though we're playing this. Sucks that I hear about the spine. Hope you get some treatment or something for it. Back issues are no joke. Oh god. Oh, thank god their bullets don't go all the way. I think I did it. Hey Cole, good to see you. Hey there, Resurge Miss. Choppier than a food processor? Oh my god. And less is useful. Y'all just gotta remember, we have eight levels of this. At least we're on stage three right now. Seeing lots of uh, green soldiers. They're priority number one. That gets you the big points. Surprise, motherfucker! Look both ways. I was good to exercise road safety, even though we're not on a road. I can't even tell what those trucks were even dropping. Were they bombs? I couldn't tell. They look like burnt hot dogs. Oh, hey there, kitty. I would look at the chat right now, but this is taking up my attention. No! I thought I could outrun that. Okay, I just stick to the corners right away so I can take out the uh the mortar cannon soldiers. Okay, I already got one out. Oh boy. Look how fast this one shoots!
Don't let the green man escape! Oh no! Oh god! Oh god! Oh, it stopped right in front of me. Oh good. I think I got another life? No, I think it was the grenades I got, not a life. Oh, I made it! Car delivery driver's not reading the directions. Yikes. You can give him as much directions as possible, and sometimes, depending on what driver you get, your mileage will vary. I thought that would just go over my head. Silly me. Putting faith in this game? And I took a rocket to the head. That, that's my name now, it's O. <laughs> oh, 113,600 points is not bad. Too bad it only got me stage 4. How's it going? It's alright. Oh, guess what? We gotta play the whole game again. <laughs> Now, full disclosure, I did put a save state at the start of level 4. I kind of feel scummy using it though, so I'm probably not going to load it yet. I know it's practically the same thing I did with the speed rumbler, because that game is brutal with only one credit as well. Just a contingency plan if we're just unable to finish this game. So I say we'll just give it another run straight from the top. Imagine this would, would be possible to do if you didn't stop to shoot anyone, but then you wouldn't get the points. And all it takes is one errant bullet to ruin everything. Remember, it took me a while to get my GameCube controller extensions because of one driver that I that I had w was parked next to my building, but wasn't sure if he had the right place, so he just left. You know, without calling my cell phone to say, "Hey, is this where you live?" So I wound up having to wait an extra day for it. I mean, thankfully it was just one day. Probably still one of my most sane experience with Intelcom.
Usually they're a little more nuts. Brag would know about that one. Hey, Russian! <laughs> He's taking a sweet time. Super Joe is taking a sweet time. I'm pretty sure the main character in Commando is named Super Joe, right? The same guy for, like, Bionic Commando. Oh, the motorcycle wheel like, actually blocked the bullet. on those wheels, let me tell ya. For some reason, the grenades are kind of easy to avoid. Just nearly everything else that's not a bullet is a little bit tougher. Played through Bionic Commando once for this, which was- Hey, The arcade version. Hopefully we'll get to the NES one real soon, because I did like that one. Even if there was, like, one stage on Bionic Commando that I hated with a passion. I think it was a level 6 or 7? please. See, that's why it's important to say please. They actually may not shoot you, because you were polite. It's like, oh, he's Canadian, let him go. We actually like maple syrup and hockey. I didn't even know what got me there. I wonder if the bullet disappeared. Oh, it's getting worse. I couldn't even turn. I was turning, but it wouldn't shoot. Like when I turned, it shot the way I was facing before. I think from, like, a game design perspective and a game quality perspective, 
This might go down as the worst game I've played so far. And yes, a speed bumper for Commodore 64 exists. But at least, for the most part, it was stable. Alright, I'm just gonna give it one more try, and if I can't beat it here, I'm just gonna give up and go on to the next game. Because constantly just looking at this is gonna make me go a bit insane. If there was a way to get those green soldiers to constantly respawn, that would be perfect. And I could just camp and get infinite points if I wanted to. I'm pretty sure they're not infinite. Capcom knows what people would do if it, if it was. Now in order for you to get a ton of lives, you have to be extremely patient. Wait! I was shooting! Up there! And I walked straight up! So if an enemy is like not in view, it doesn't have a hitbox? But I do? Cause there's no way that enemy could have survived, I was shooting straight up. Okay, that time it worked. So maybe it was just like, off to the side back then. Maybe I actually did miss. Guess I have to give the game the benefit of the doubt. I don't want to. <laughs> what the? Now the bullet disappeared. Three six hundred is my best score, and I made it as far as stage four. Just gonna write that down. Yeah, I I, I give up on this game. 